Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all will be doing well. So today we will talk about potato bugs as its damage is so severe that it was even considered as a biological weapon in the middle of the 20th century and immigrated from the US, the adult bugs, young bugs and larvae destroy a potato patch with complete defoliation. Tomatoes will also not be spared but it doesn't need to get this far because there are effective combat strategies available. Basically, there are two vital steps that gardeners need to take. First, you have to take preventative measures to keep them away. And if you are lucky, then you won't have to, um, you know, face a problem with them at all. And then we will take a look at the methods of how to get rid of the potato bugs. And most importantly, we will focus on organic methods because we don't want to spray potentially harmful chemicals on our vegetable plants. Those chemicals seep into the veggies that grow on the plants and you don't want to eat that. So let's get started. The powdery substance also known as diatomaceous earth which we have already discussed in our previous videos as well is one of my favorite weapons against garden pests because it has saved my family from losing large portions of our garden to beetles, moths and other crawling things. So diatomaceous earth which is you know also known as DA is not new. A popular you know topic of discussion of many gardeners in recent times and it is an organic gardening pesticide that has been used by some farmers and pest control professionals for decades. Another step to defeating potato bugs is using diatomaceous earth to dust lightly over the plants as evenly as possible and do this wherever you find pest. Some people think that DE which is diatomaceous earth of course doesn't work too well but I have found great success with it especially for the smaller larva and I love that it, it is so easy to use and you don't have to mix with the you know with water or spray anything plus it's safe to use at any time of the day and just don't use too much because it could uh, you know kill some of the good bugs that you really want in your garden. So keep watching my channel, do subscribe to it and press the bell icon. Bye bye.